I repeat, I am willing to send Mr. Ambrose a thousand dollars. Now, pounds that they use for you, okay? Let's make it a thousand pounds. I'm willing to send Mr. Ambrose a thousand pounds today. Hold on. Let, I want to. Hello, please let me have your phone. I want to make some calls. Hello, Janice Hello, good afternoon. Please press one for new inquiries to book a test or to speak to a member of our clinical advisor team. Please press two. Hello, how can I help? Yeah, hello, how you doing? I'm good, thank you. How are you? Fine, thank you. Is that DNA testing in Belfast? Um, you call through to our head office, but we do have a clinic in Belfast, yeah. Yeah, please, can you tell me how much is a DNA testing for my son? Yeah, is it a paternity test that you're looking for, for child and father? Yes. And we do two types. We do one that's called peace of mind, which is just for your own personal information. Or we do a test that can be used legally. Which one would be more applicable to you? Um, either would be fine. I just want to make sure that uh, he is my son. Yeah. So if it's the peace of mind one. I want to have a peace of mind, not, yes. Yeah, if it's only just for your own personal information, they're 240 pounds. 240 pounds. And how soon can I get the result? Say that again, sorry. How soon can I get the result? So the results are three to four working days from receipt of the samples at the lab. Three to four working days, right? Yeah, from receipt at the lab. Okay, no problem. I will make some inquiries and I'll get back to you. Thank you so much. No worries at all. Have a lovely day. God bless you. Thank you. Bye. Okay. There you go. Huh? This thing is not expensive. We need to fight for that boy so that we can put an end to this issue. Let's put an end to it. And I don't want you guys to start bullying this boy. It's wrong. Everywhere, J-Boy. Justice for J-Boy. Me, I've joined the matter now. Justice for J-Boy. Justice for J-Boy. Yes. The young man deserves to know who his father is. If you cannot defend that, then you don't need to come online bullying other people. If you cannot defend, if you cannot show us that J-Boy belongs to the man you call his father, then you don't need to come online bullying people. Okay? Our... Me and radio, this fight is a fight for all people. We are going to fight it. Then the person that is going to lose will not say, okay, I'm sorry. Yes, it's just like a, a bossing match. Now, a bossing match today, so bossing match. Bossing match is a bossing game. Hello, police switchboard. How can I help you? Uh, is that the Belfast police? I'll try and get you through there, right, sir. Please do. Thank you for calling the police service of Northern Ireland. Your call may be recorded. All of our call handlers are currently busy. Please continue to hold. Ah, is there where, 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 where? Eh? By the time police start calling you, by the time your name start being in public records, by the time you start having different cases, maybe then you will understand that it's not even worth it. Since everybody wants to fight, let the fight begin. I will put my address, I will put my office address in America, my house address, I will put it online. So that those who want to use it, use it as well. Okay? Only $240, $240 pounds. Now we we'll discussed two years ago. I'll pay the money. I'm Bruce. I'm Bruce Nobia Jala. I am going to pay the money. Call me. I will transfer the money to you immediately. If you are a victim of crime, the PSNI may contact you as part of our victim satisfaction survey. We live in a country where law work. Now the PS there's somebody with a bullet up online. I know if you talk. Make, make your research and make some calls. That's what you need to do. I can be in breakfast tomorrow if I want to. Yes. Uh, it has to stop. For somebody, for somebody that have children in school, you'll be... Hello? You want to say again? Hello, good afternoon. I just want to contribute to you. Yeah, greet you, brother. How far now? I'm good, sir. I'm good. This matter, I'm glad. Uh, Chief, please, I want to beg you categorically not to... Give them too many informations because you know the you know how far we've been. Cut it, cut it, cut it. Yeah, go ahead. 
we just want these persons to to know what they are doing is wrong and to also try and realize what they are doing and if possible if they refuse to they be likely going for it no so but but we but but they are still online ranting they are still yeah, online ranting you know, no the insult on adult people is too much please the insult on Edo people, not just a God sent foundation, the insult on the Edo nation is too much. We have a, a king to protect. No, I, I want you to be on the public information. We are not hiding anything. There's, we are not hiding any information. We are telling you what we are going to do. So those of them who have money to get a lawyer should have their lawyers ready. A God sent foundation, I personally can put up to $10,000 on it. Because it's very unfair. Somebody will do something, you come online, oh, go, 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 go. do you know how many times they have insulted my mom? You think I'm happy about that? Do you know how many times they have insulted my family? But because I keep cool? One of, one of the things is that they don't even know what the meaning of bully is. Go and do your research and know what the meaning of bully is first. If you know the meaning of bully, you cannot even come out on, it, on a social media platform to try and even bully others. But when you go into the GDPR law, the laws are stated there, but... You know what? Ignorance is a very big disease. They don't know these things. So it's in the public domain. Go and do your research. Go on the GDPR law. You have no statutory right whatsoever to post someone's picture without the person's consent. Talk to say using defamatory uh, words on such, as, such individuals. So all of this, like I believe so much on a legal fight. And it's not all about me. It's not all about the names that have been mentioned. But we just want to use this to serve as an example for every one person out there that is going, that is bullying or trying to deform one, 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 uh, someone else's character. So please, sir, uh, do not give too many information. You know how far we've been there. We've, we've gone. It's all right. It's, 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 it's all right. It's all right. I've, I've heard you. Thank but you. whatever we are doing, bro, is not is not a secret. All right, it's not a secret. We have our evidence and we are pursuing a legal case. So it's not something that we have to say, oh, it's not a secret. It's not a secret cut. I don't believe in keeping things a secret. I'm the most transparent and open person. If I'm going to beat you up, I'm going to tell you I'm going to beat you. If I see you, I'm going to beat you. It's straight up. If you beat me, I will apologize. I am not too prideful to say I'm sorry. And that is one good attribute that I have. If I am wrong, you tell me you are wrong. I'm going to tell you, please, not verse. That's my attitude. So where can we, how can people be living in a country that has laws? In a country where we say they will feel remove you from one area because you'll be bullied. They can remove you from a certain area when they find out that you are a bully. Your children are in school in that community. And you know that way that this video can be gathered, taken to your children's school to say uh, they can even remove your children from you. Knowing that this is how you treat other people's children. People are not smart. All right. Thank you so much. All right, all callers, I thank you all so much. A lot of people have been calling me. I can't take all calls, but we just take the best one we can take. But those of you who are ranting online, continue to rant. And uh, if you are looking for me, I'm going to share my office address in Texas. I'm going to share my ass address. I'm going to share my phone number after this video. So that in case you want to make a report. Because any reports you make, once they have done their research, they're going to give me an award. If you report the Onosage, say you do this, once they make their research, because in the Western world, you can't just say something and people believe you. It's almost impossible. It's almost impossible for you to lay a report and they just believe you without a research. Hello, good afternoon. So, hello brother. Good afternoon. Well done. Hello, good afternoon. Good afternoon. I should hold on. Go ahead, bro. Well done. Yeah. Dr. Kadu, please. We are extremely in support of what you are doing through your God sent foundation. But this issue of cyber bullying, you are in the right track. But you still posting the picture on your wall. It seems you are doing exactly what you are fighting against. It does not call for. Okay, you are sir. going about it legally. Okay, so sir. Nothing, you posting the picture is a call for. Okay, sir. Okay, sir. I will use your advice, and I'm very sorry about that, sir. I will take that down, sir. Thank you very much. I appreciate it. God bless you, bro. Thank you. Yeah, we are not we are not too prideful to learn. I am not the most smartest person. When I was growing up in school, I was a class prefect. I attended a dokbolo 
uh, secondary school in New Bini. Class one, class two, class three, class four, class five. I was a class prefect. My nickname was Schoolboy. Those of you who know me, Schoolboy was my nickname. That's because I was extremely smart. And I'm still smart. So because we are on cyber space, doesn't make us, uh, you know, we can we kind of put some things aside. Or maybe people will value me more if I go online and uh, snap a picture of my GLE, see me, or all the bottle of champagne. But you see on my social media page, I use it to promote good cause. I use it to say, you know, let's help this person. I use it to say, this is the business that we are doing now. Let's make money together. Maybe I should stop and start you buying Versace. Hmm? Is without. Maybe I should start buying Versace and showing it. Okay? So, um, my people, uh, I think uh, that is it for now. Uh, we are pursuing legal processes against you, Monica, and the husband. Because uh, I understand that Monica had one legal battle before now. Uh, they sent that to me. Uh, so the husband is the one helping us set up the system. So automatically, he is also a cyber bully. And uh, for you kids, mm, yeah, yours is already in the process. Um, the goal is to make you understand that what you are doing is a crime. And uh, you are going to pay for destroying our reunion. Mm, and that's it. And after we won this battle, this is Monica. Somebody's Monica, see another legal battle they don't ever give you. Only you won. <laughs> huh? Somebody said that you know, Sagi, it is against the law to post somebody's uh, address online. It's not against the law. Addresses are public records. Okay, Monica's address is right here. It's 